Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, and today I have my Baby Alive dolls with me, um, because I just got a package off of eBay, and it's filled with a bunch of Baby Alive accessories and stuff, so I'm gonna be opening that up today, so let's get started. So here's the box, um, the only thing that I have done so far is take off the shipping label, so I did get this off of eBay, and I looked at other, um, listings too so i sort of remember what's in this one but not really so it's gonna be kind of like a surprise for all of us so i'm just gonna open it up here see if i can get all the tape off um hold on i'm gonna pause it because i don't want this to take too long okay i got the tape off so so we have like some little Ooh, i love these i'll have to pop that later <laughs> And then a pack of baby life stuff. So that's really cool. Okay. So that was it. This is pretty much the whole thing. Let's just get it all out. It's, it's kind of a lot. <laughs> Hold on, let me get organized. Okay, I got my stuff all organized. <laughs> so what I got is this little baby doll mixer. This is actually why I wanted to get this lot. Because I wanted a... A better mixer to make baby food for Olivia. So I think this is from the Sweet Spoonfuls baby. Um, it's really cool. And it's actually a lot bigger than I expected. <laughs> um, see it has a little Baby Alive logo. And some almost oh, little fruits. That's cute. I didn't notice that. <laughs> and then it came with two Baby Alive spoons. They're both pink. Um, I don't really know if I need more spoons. I have one for Olivia. But I guess I could always use them if like one's dirty. <laughs> Um, there's also three packs of Baby Alive juice, so there's two apple juice packs and then one orange juice. And there's lots of baby food, so there's one, two, three, four, five, six broccoli, one, two, three, four, five, and six pear. So, can make some food for Olivia. Um, it comes with a little Baby Alive comb to like brush out the doll's hair. Um, I do have a comb for Josephine already. This is hers, but now she has just a little different color, so that's really nice. <laughs> um, it has two Baby Alive diapers, so these are, like, actually Baby Alive brand. Um, I think I've really only ever had, <laughs> like, off-brand Baby Alive diapers, but that's okay, so two extra diapers, really helpful. And then also another Baby Alive bottle, which is great because I have been wanting another bottle <laughs> for my dolls so yeah that's pretty much all that this lot came with um i think that'll probably wash the bottle and like the mixer and everything so i'm just gonna go wash all this stuff off and then we're gonna feed olivia with some of the stuff so i'll be back in a minute Okay, so all of the plastic Baby Life items are now all clean and dry, and I'm actually going to be feeding Olivia, so I'm going to use that mixer and this new bottle, and I'm just going to take one of the spoons and we'll put this stuff out of the way. Okay, so I have Miss Olivia here, and I'm going to be making her some orange doll juice. And I'm also going to give, be giving her some pear doll food because I don't know if she likes broccoli or not. And I figured pear was a <laughs> safer option. So I'm going to put her juice probably in this one because it has like a smaller opening kind of that the juice can come out of. So maybe she'll drink it slower. And then I'm going to use this bottle. This is Josephine's bottle, but they share. I'm going to fill this one with water just to wash everything down. Um... I'm going to mix up her doll food in this, and I'm actually really happy to have this because I used to use this to put all the doll food in, like I just put it in and kind of shake it up, you know? But that's not really how you're meant to use it, so it would all come out of this top even if I held this down really firm and like over here, so hopefully this will make less of a mess. <laughs> and after we mix it up in there, I'm going to pour it all into her little bowl and we'll use her new spoon to feed her. So yeah, let's get started making all her food. Okay, so I'm gonna make her food first. So I have this little pear doll food. Um, and it says, let me read the back. It says about three teaspoons of water. 
I don't really have a measurement, but there is a little line right there at the bottom. So I'm going to assume that that's about three teaspoons. <laughs> have my water bottle here. So I'm just going to fill it up to that little line. Oop. I put a little too much. <laughs> but I think we'll just take some of it out with this bottle because I don't want to put too much and have it too liquidy. Hold on. Okay. There we go. I think that's about good. And then there's some water in that bottle. And then we're going to take the doll food. If I can open it. One second. Okay, so I got it open. Um, you can see the powder. It's kind of yellowy. So... I guess because it's supposed to be like lime green instead of dark green. So we're just going to pour it in the thing. There we go. So it's all, it's mostly empty. Just get all the rest of it out. And then I think we put the lid on. And we'll mix it up. Let's see. Can you guys see? Trying to move my fingers out of the way. So, you stir it up like that, I guess. That seems to be working. Sorry, I'm trying to look at it and not look at the camera. So, you just stir it up real good, I guess. Pull it back a little. I don't know how much I'm supposed to stir it because I've never really had like a doll mixer before. Um, food mixer. It looks pretty mixed up right now. Kind of looks like vomit. <laughs> um, but she only, the lady that I bought this from, or the person I bought this from only sent me like green doll food because that was all that was in the lot. So I guess she's going to have to eat kind of puke colored food. <laughs> it's still a little chunky. Um, Maybe that's just because the doll food is old. Hold on, I'm going to add a little more water and mix it up some more and then I'll get back to you guys. Um, I don't know if you can see, but it does look considerably less chunky after adding a little more water and mixing it up. It's almost kind of sparkly on camera. <laughs> so, yeah, so I'm going to pour that into her little food dish and I'll also show you guys um, as I make her juice. All right, I've got her bottle here, um, and I already poured the food into her bowl. So now let's make her juice. And this says to use 30 milliliters of water, um, but it looks like from the picture they filled up pretty much the whole bottle. And it has some little markings here. So I'm gonna fill it up to just this part right here, this to the second marking, just to be safe. And then if it's too thick. Oop, we can add a little more. This looks like it's a really old package. So I don't know if it'll work. It still looks like powder. It doesn't look like it's too clumpy. So I think it'll probably be fine. Just pour it in there. Um then I'll fill it up to that second line. Let's see. I'm going to try to show you guys too, but. Okay. So I filled it up, and I'm just going to shake it up a little. And then we'll see what consistency it is. Um, the baby doll food consistency, it looks pretty much like baby food. And it's a little bit chunky still, but it's not bad. I think Olivia will be able to handle it. Let's see. How thick is that? Hmm. Can you guys see? It doesn't look too bad. I think I'll give her just a little more water in it. Um, just so that she can have, like, more to drink, you know? Um. I'm going to shake it up a little more. And then we'll fill up her water bottle. I probably won't do that on camera. Um, and then we'll start feeding her. Shake that up more. Okay. 
So that looks pretty good. Um, yeah. So I'm going to fill up her water and then we'll feed her. Okay, so I'm going to try and feed her kind of quickly because this video is getting a little long and the last time I tried to upload a long video, it took forever. <laughs> so we're going to feed her some of this food. You can see it does look pretty much like baby food. It's a little thick, but not too bad. Let's see. Can you drink it or eat it? Ooh, there you go. No, down nicely. Ew, there's a hair on her. Sorry. <laughs> Okay, well, she ate that pretty well, actually. That went down a lot better than some of the homemade food that I have for her. But I like this spoon, though. Because with my other spoon, um, it's kind of flat, you know? It can't really pick that much up. And it spills all over her face. Like, there's barely any spillage right now. That's pretty cool. Where's her juice? Okay. Here, we're going to give her a little bit of orange juice. Does this fit in her mouth? Almost. For a little bit. It's kind of hard to squeeze this bottle. Oh, that fits perfectly in her mouth. Oh, okay. I like this. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, it's kind of hard to squeeze the bottle. It's pretty, like, a hard plastic. Give her some more food. Let's see. Yeah, so this food is still a little chunky. But she is still eating it pretty well, so that's good. Here, let's tilt her back a little. It looks like she likes it. <laughs> um, I would do a voice for her, but kind of the last time I did baby doll voices in the last video, it didn't sound <laughs> like baby voices, um, so I'm just not going to have her talk this time until I can actually do a good baby voice <laughs> all right um i'm gonna give her a little water so i have this for her water just, just give it to her okay so i'm gonna finish feeding her off camera just so that this video doesn't get too long and then we'll get back to you guys all right so olivia finished all her food and her juice juice bottles all empty so is her water so she ate everything um so she liked it, she thought it was good, but now there's food all over her and she needs a bath. <laughs> so that's it for today's video. Thanks for watching. Bye everyone!